Hello, my name is Aaron Bryan. I'm the Marketing Manager for Measurement Solutions at Draeger in North America. Today, I'm going to show you some of the important features of the Draeger UCF 6000, 7000, and 9000 thermal imaging cameras. These cameras are intrinsically safe, having met UL Class 1 Division 2 requirements. They provide a large, crystal clear image, one hand operation for ease of use, and they're extremely robust. One of the most important features of these cameras is the user's ability to select from an array of imaging modes depending on their needs. When the camera starts up, it automatically switches into standard mode. The standard mode is the mode used most often for fire suppression and takes full advantage of the camera's extended dynamic range. This wide range makes it possible to identify objects and people even in intense heat. In addition to the standard mode, the Draeger thermal imaging cameras offer other modes that increase the camera's flexibility and usefulness. As we review the various modes, keep in mind that simply pressing the green power button will send the camera back into standard mode. The next mode is person mode. The person mode enhances image details on the cooler objects in the scene to help clearly identify victims. For example, if a firefighter or victim is next to a high heat source, the camera operating in standard mode might automatically switch to a higher dynamic range for a better view of the heat source. Person mode prevents this, keeping the focus on cooler objects in the scene, like a victim. The person mode enhances your ability to clearly distinguish individuals in most scenarios. While operating in person mode, pressing the green button sends the camera back to the default standard mode. Fire mode is the opposite of person mode. It enhances image details on high heat objects. In the fire mode, the Draeger thermal imaging camera allows the user to manually switch the camera to the next dynamic range without waiting for the camera's programmed kick-in point. This gives firefighters more flexibility and allows them to choose what they want to focus on. The thermal scan mode highlights a set temperature threshold. This feature is great for size up, overhaul, looking for overheated ballast, and smell of smoke response calls. This feature has a separate menu that allows you to adjust the temperature threshold up or down by pressing the arrows left or right. Once you select the temperature threshold, press the down arrow to lock in that desired temperature. The color reference bar on the right side of the display indicates the temperature you have chosen. The displayed image now highlights anything at or above that locked in temperature. Remember, in order to go back to standard mode, simply press the green button. In hazmat mode, small ambient temperature differences are shown with a higher contrast. Hazmat mode, present only on the UCF 9000, is used to find spilled liquids, identify liquid levels in a container, and more. Outdoor mode is also called reverse polarity mode. In this mode, hot objects now appear dark and cool objects appear light. Outdoor mode is useful for nighttime operations or search and rescue operations. For example, during search and rescue operations, outdoor mode can help you locate victims. Thermal scan plus mode combines an optical black and white image and a thermal image. This feature allows you to clearly identify all objects in the room and highlight areas that are above a set temperature. Like all optical cameras, Operation in thermal scan mode requires visible light to fully function. This mode is helpful during smell of smoke response calls, overhaul, size up, and more. This feature is again only available on the UCF 9000 model. In addition to its thermal imaging capabilities, the UCF 9000 has an integral digital video camera. This is listed in the menu as visual mode. It can be used to record firefighter training, hazmat operations, or as an intrinsically safe color camera. Thanks to the black box feature that records up to two hours of video, the normal mode color camera has quickly become one of the favorite features on the UCF 9000. The last mode is custom mode. Custom mode allows you to choose which options are best for your department's needs. Custom mode is available only on the UCF 9000 and is adjusted with the included software. 
Understanding all of the modes of the Draeger UCF thermal imaging cameras will better allow you to use the cameras to their fullest potential. Remember, from any of the operating modes, simply pressing the green power button switches the camera back to the default standard mode. Thank you for watching and stay safe.